Hello everyone, and welcome back to the channel. It's an exciting time for Iraqi dinar enthusiasts, as August has brought some truly explosive news from Iraq. We're seeing major changes to the banking system and currency auctions, driven by significant pressure from the Federal Reserve and the US Treasury. In today's video, we'll break down these developments, explore what they mean for Iraq's financial future, and discuss how these changes could impact the value of the dinar. Make sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any updates. First, let's talk about the changes in the banking system. Over the past month, we've seen a series of reforms and adjustments aimed at cleaning up and modernizing Iraq's financial sector. These changes are part of a broader effort to stabilize the economy and bring more transparency to financial transactions. The pressure from the Federal Reserve and the U.S. Treasury has played a crucial role in these reforms. By pushing for these changes, the U.S. is encouraging Iraq to adopt more rigorous financial practices and align its banking system with international standards. One of the key areas of focus has been the parallel market rate versus the official rate set by the Central Bank of Iraq, CBI. The parallel market, or black market, rate often differs significantly from the official rate, creating discrepancies that can affect everything from trade to investment. The recent reforms aim to address this issue by narrowing the gap between these rates and ensuring that the official rate more accurately reflects the true value of the Iraqi dinar. This alignment is crucial for fostering investor confidence and promoting economic stability. Another significant aspect of the reforms is the adjustment of currency auction levels. Currency auctions have long been a tool used by the CBI to manage the exchange rate and control the money supply. However, there have been concerns about the transparency and effectiveness of these auctions. The new changes are intended to make these auctions more transparent and efficient, reducing the potential for corruption and ensuring that the currency is traded at more accurate rates. This shift is expected to help stabilize the dinar and improve its value on the international stage. According to my contact at the CBI, keeping an eye on the progress of these banking reforms is essential. The reforms are being closely monitored, and their impact on the parallel market rate and currency auction levels will be crucial in determining the future stability of Iraq's financial system. As the Federal Reserve and U.S. Treasury continue to apply pressure, these reforms are likely to evolve and adapt, potentially leading to even more significant changes in the coming months. That's all for today's update. I hope you found this deep dive into the recent changes in Iraq's banking system and currency auctions insightful. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe for more news and analysis on the Iraqi dinar and global financial trends. I'd love to hear your thoughts on these developments so how do you think they'll affect Iraq's economy? Drop your comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.